Hello everybody, welcome back to Sensations. We're continuing with the uh, Pride Route today. So, let's open it up here. Uh, Alright, grab some water in here real quick. schedule to make sure you're not missing something you scheduled. I don't know where I'd be without you, Josh. I do have a little bit of bad news. <clears throat> oh, why? <coughs> if this is going to ruin my day, just don't tell me. Uh, he wants to know, of course, curious, of course. Curiosity doesn't mean he's not going to like it. Of course, he's not going to like it. All right. Mm. Mm. I didn't actually mean that. You have to tell me. Uh, of course. So, why say don't tell me? Because you know you want to know, right? It's nothing major, but Superboy fell to the number two spot today. What? Who's number one? Some artist named Charity Case. Relatively new. She has a new single called Shallow Trust that is, by all accounts, pretty catchy. <coughs> Have you listened to it? I did. It's nothing compared to your stuff, but Superboy has been on top for over two months. It's to be expected. Yeah, come on. It's been up there for like two months. Get used to it. You know? If you want to be back on top, just make a... Write, write some better songs, you know? Shit, come up, come up with something better. I thought Coast K and I dating would be enough to push it a few more weeks. That's disappointing. Yeah, like uh, Kosuke and you dating is gonna uh, keep you on top, right? Yeah, I don't think so. It's not. It's not for you, okay? It's not gonna. It's not gonna. Fi it's not gonna fix you, okay? Sorry. But not you, babe. Disappointing that this new harlot took number one when I'm doing so much good. I bet she doesn't even donate anything at all. She does. In fact, she's doing a lot of the same work as you are. Okay, well, that, yeah, that's just copying what he's doing. But even so, just, you know, keep doing what you're doing and, and do better. You know, jeez. Seriously? This bitch is going to copy me and get <coughs> the number one spot doing it? Well, someone copying you means that you're doing something right, right? Yeah, I don't know about that. I guess. It's still so fucking stupid. I'd never be copying someone's style. Imagine trying to live with yourself knowing you're just a pale imitation. Yeah, he's jealous. 
He's uh, he's jealous, obviously. Don't worry about her, Luke. Do you have any new singles coming out? Not recently. I've been so busy. Maybe I should have been working on that. Yeah, exactly. I'm sure between everything you have going on, you're doing what you can. It's not enough, though. I'll have to figure out some way back on top. Charity case is supposed to be at Red Rocks tonight as well. Should I take you elsewhere? I wouldn't want you to have an unpleasant time. No, 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 no. This is perfect. There might be an opportunity here. We'll definitely go. <laughs> We'd hate to miss out on meeting her. <sighs> right. Pride falls silent as he considers things. Josh drives us up to the front of Red Rocks, a stylish bar and club with an adjoining restaurant. There's a bunch of people outside waiting to take photos. We get out, and Josh hands the keys to a valet. Several flashes blind me briefly as we walk towards the club entrance. Pride soaks up the attention and seems less irritated now. She may have taken the number one spot, but can she draw a crowd the way I do? Probably not. She's still relatively unknown. That's damn right. <clears throat> Before we can make it inside, a black limousine suddenly rolls up. A song blares from the interior, and a short woman steps out. Oh, that's her, Luke. That's Charity Case. Are you being serious right now? Totally serious. Pride looks at me, like I'm supposed to clarify things for him. Why are you looking at me for him? He is being totally serious right now. Yeah, we obviously get that. I'll be right back. Pride walks confidently over to Charity Case and her small entourage. She looks at him somewhat surprised, then pastes on a fake grin for the cameras. Oh my gosh, is that America's Superboy? The one and only? I had no idea you'd be here tonight. I had no idea you'd be here either. Congratulations on your number one single. Oh, you're so sweet. Thank you so much. If only there was a way we could share the number one spot, I'd do that. Oh my gosh, wouldn't that be great? Don't worry, I'm sure I'll be back there sooner than anyone thinks. Oh my gosh, let's take a few pictures together. People will love it. I'm totally down. Be sure to tag me in them when you post them. Girl, of <coughs> course. Pride flips his hair and poses for a few photos, then walks back over to Josh and I. Yeah, they're both acting so fake. That trifling bitch needs a lesson in humility. Jealous much? Seriously? What's up? She just does, Josh. She just does. Get over it, man. We walk inside, and the interior of Red Rocks is dark and loud. Typical to clubs, I guess. A small bar off to the left gets drinks for waiting patrons, and the line to actually get into the club or on the dance floor extends off to the right. Someone needs to, uh, just smack Pride. I mean, if I were close gay, I would just smack some sense in him. It's like, get over it. I mean,. If you don't like the situation, just, you know, make, come up with some better songs, you know, and, uh, do better, you know? Josh, I want the most expensive table and the most expensive alcohol. I don't care what it costs. <clears throat> sure, let me go see what I can do. Josh, hey, can you get me a drink? I'm in distress. Of course. Thanks, babe. But, uh, I think you're worrying a bit much about the number one spot. 
I know, I wouldn't be tripping. I mean, it was up there for like two months, so. I mean, things change. You know, th stuff happens. Why, why, uh, why, uh, why worry about it, you know? You know you're doing, if you're, you, you know you're already doing well anyway, so you're trying to do well anyway. Or just trying to be fake about it, I don't know, what the hell. But still, if it were me, I wouldn't worry about it. I'd be like, okay, so what? I lost the number one spot. Who cares? I was up there for like two months and, you know, I'm doing what I can, you know. That's what, that's what I would be. I wouldn't be so fake ass like this guy, though. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. This is why we're together, Kosuke. You keep me grounded. Yeah, well, trying to, but you're not helping. Hey, come here. Give me a kiss through the cameras. Pride gives me a kiss, and a few cameras flash. Just try to enjoy yourself tonight. You've been worrying for later. You know, you've already accomplished so much, but people's interests are fickle. Yep. You're... you're right. Thanks, babe. You're the best. Oh, I know it. I walk over to the bar and look at the prices. Twenty dollars for a drink? Just to come with a blowjob? Two. <laughs> What is this place on the strip or something? Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, I could see it if it's on the strip. Places like that tend to overcharge on their drinks. They're really expensive. <clears throat> so, I mean, unless you got money to spend on the strip, you know, go for it. But if not, no, yeah. I mean, you still get good drinks elsewhere, and not have to pay up, pay out the nose, you know. Well, either way, pride asked for a drink. What should I get him? Hmm. I think he likes six on the beach, so yeah, I'll get him that. I walk over to the bar, and there's an overworked bartender there hurriedly taking shouted orders over the thumping music. I wait my turn, shout my order to him when he's ready. Oh, I got us a blue barrel, that's good. <coughs> Sex on the beach, please. Double? Sure. Yeah, I think he needs it anyway. It might help him calm down. 1890. Yeah, it is a bit much for a drink. The bartender dashes off to grab some fruit pieces before I can charm him. Anything else? Uh, can you put this on Luke Gallo's tab? Oh yeah, no problem. Tell Luke I say hello. Will do, thanks. I walk back over to Pride. He's taking a group photo with some fans. <laughs> Kosuke! Everyone, meet Kosuke, my boyfriend! A few people loudly say hi, and I awkwardly wave back. Hey. Kosuke, is that a sex on the beach? You know me so well. Come over here, take a photo with us. I, uh... Alright. I squash awkwardly next to Pride, based on a smile from the woman taking the picture. Pride says goodbye to his new best friends of five minutes. Thanks! Oh, thank you! You're beautiful! Have fun tonight! I'll tag you! I'll tag you! See ya! Here's your drink. Thank you, babe. I appreciate that you got me my favorite. You're so considerate. <clears throat> no problem. Are we going to head in anytime soon? Well, I thought we were already inside here. I mean, it looks like we're already inside the bar. I'd love to, but we're waiting on Josh. 
I've got us a table booked. The club is a little crowded right now, so it was a little tricky. <coughs> is it the best table? That, um... That was reserved for Charity and her crew tonight. Oh boy. Uh, this is not gonna go well. Mm -hmm. Well, at least we have a table, right? On a crowded night, that has to be difficult. You're right, Kosuke. Thank you, Josh. Well, shall we head in? I'm dying to hear this new song that everyone is going insane for. Yeah, right this way. I'll take you to our table. We walk into the actual nightclub, and the music is softer in here than it is outside. Bizarre. A bunch of TV screens encircle the club, playing music <coughs> videos and music synth waves. Josh navigates us to our table, but already has a few bottles of high-priced vodka on it, and some glassware for serving it. Nice! At least it's not too close to that charity and her gaggle of bimbos. I tried to avoid that. See, your manager is even trying to help, so chill out, man. Have I ever told you that you're the best? <laughs> Only every day? Why don't you hang out with us tonight? Another handsome guy at the table wouldn't hurt. <laughs> Flattering, but I'll let you and Kosuke have fun. There's a couple people here I wanted to catch up with, mainly the owner of Red Rocks. It's good to make connections for future events, you know? Josh, you're my favorite manager, and I mean that. I'm your only manager, Luke. But if you weren't the only one, there would be no competition. <laughs> Text if you need anything, or if you're ready to go. Mm, that's kind of a nice thing to say, if you meant it. Bye, Josh! Later. Josh is the best. Well, I guess if he, if he meant, means it. He's very handy and personable. Traits that make a great manager. I can see why you like him. Yeah. Okay, on to ideas. I need ideas. Ideas? For what? How are we going to shove charity off the charts? Uh... Oh, we could try to provoke her into saying something awful and catching it on video. Luke, I think, uh... What? I think you're taking it a little personally. She probably has no problems with you at all. Probably, but singers <coughs> feud all the time. It keeps them relevant. I guess it just seems fake and petty to me. I think you should be happy that you're still on the chart after so many weeks. Isn't that a pretty huge deal? I know, right? Yes, but I take my work very seriously, and I want to be <coughs> the best. You are the best. Do you really think so? I mean, Charity is emulating you. Isn't that proof enough? Oh my gosh, is that Luke Gallo and his boyfriend? Charity! Oh my goodness, come here, let me look at your hair! It looks so perfect. Luke! I need to be introduced to your boyfriend. That is totally my fault, I can be so stupid sometimes. <laughs> Charity, I'd like you to meet the love of my life, Kosuke. Kosuke? This is Charity. She's an up-and-coming star. It's nice to meet you. Did you know Luke before tonight? Kosuke, I've known Luke since back when he was dating his own manager. Who was that again, Luke? Jason? Hirano? And now she's uh, mispronouncing Kosuke's name, calling it Kosuke or whatever. Very joke. <laughs> You're so forgetful. His name is Josh. We're still super close. 
Oh, I'm so glad to hear. He's such a cutie. But really, your own manager? If only I could pull off a scandal like you did. I'm sure you could live your best whole life if you want to. Ooh, just call her a hole. <laughs> so, Luke, why Kosuke? He must be super special to attract you. Get the name right, lady. Oh, Kosuke is special. I can't talk too much about what makes him special, but let's just say it's his prowess in the bedroom. Ha ha ha! Kosuke has those sweet little moves, huh? Mm-hmm. Maybe my next thing will be about him. He gives me so much inspiration. Goodness, must be a real wizard in the sheets, Kosuke. Well, it was so, so nice chatting with you. My stupid friends over there are waiting for me. Stop by and say hey before you guys leave tonight. Oh, we so will, Charity. Have fun! Charity flounces off to rejoin the group she came with. Pride gives a little wave goodbye, and then turns to me, a fake smile on his face. I just want to claw that bitch's eyes out! Oh, chill out, come on. She's just trying to get, get y'all riled up. That's all she's trying to do. Wow, she seemed, uh, all right to me. Yeah, well, she was being fake, you could tell. Oh, she wasn't. You're just unaware of how shitty celebrities can be. Not your fault, babe. I know you just want to see the good in people, and that's so admirable. Yeah, I guess I'm clueless if she was being nasty to you in that, uh, conversation. Oh, she was. She definitely was. But, bitch, I have to think of something to propel myself back into the spotlight. Why not just make a new song? Exactly. I could, but nobody is expecting that so soon after my tour ended. You could always surprise them. Or... Or... I've got a great idea. It could be great, anyway. What is it? I could leak some sex pictures from my phone. Maybe say I got hacked. People would be all over it. That seems kind of extreme. They don't have to actually show anything. Just suggestive of what we're doing. Hmm. I can tell you're not super on board. Well, if it doesn't show anything and it'll make you less stressed about things, uh, sure, why not? You're so caring, Kosuke! I can't believe I didn't think of this sooner! This is just what we need! Before Pride can tell me more about his amazing idea, our table is joined by a few obviously intoxicated people. Luke! Come dance with us! Who's this? <gasps> is this your new boyfriend? This is my new boyfriend! So great to meet you! Great to meet you guys. Do you guys want to come down and dance? The DJ is going to put on some hot new track, and we don't want to miss that. <clears throat> I feel Pride's smile freeze onto his face. What an unlucky question. Oh, I think I'm alright, but why don't you go have a dance, Kosuke? Okay? <laughs> yeah! Luke can watch you shake your money maker. Hmm. Oh, it's fine, babe. I'll get some video of it to post later. I'm sure everyone will love it. <sighs> I follow the dancers down to the dance floor, and the DJ turns on a club version of Charity's song Shallow Trust. I can tell it's the song, because the words Shallow Trust keep repeating over and over. Uh, that's lame. Okay, yeah, I can hear it playing in the background, sort of, yeah. And you're really wanting us to dance with these, these 
Drunk girls? I mean, come on, really? This song probably had 20 writers for it, too. Come on, dance with me. Show me what you got. The girl that first talked to Pride shakes her chest in my face, then grinds her ass into my crotch. Oh, God. I know, right? <laughs> Get it! I see Pride off to the side filming me, so I decide to really get into it. Really give the social media world something to talk about. Okay. I grab onto the hips of the woman in front of me and grind into her vigorously. I give her ass a few fake slaps for good measure. She seems really into it. I see a bunch of flashes light up around me. It's hard to tell who it is, but I'm betting it's a bunch of charities group too. After another minute, the song ends and flows into a new one. I squeeze through the crowd and make my way back to Pride. Seemed like you enjoyed yourself a little bit. Not really. Hey, I didn't want to dance. Well, that will make for some great buzz <coughs> from the fans. You did great! Thanks? No problem. I'm tired of this club, though. I think we should head out and put my master plan into motion. I'm ready whenever you are. Season 71 of Las Vegas Lust is getting spicy! Pride's gonna release some notes! He genius! Oh, these guys again. He said he's not gonna show anything. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, 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 that's what they all say. I, for one, know better than that. And let me tell you, I wouldn't mind holding the camera. Yeah, I bet. I wonder what happens next. Does Pride's plan work? Does Charity get knocked off her pedestal? Does Koski give Pride the inner peace he's never had and would so desperately? Uh, no. We should console Lucifer's future finder. I can't wait to see what happens next. This is important! This is why you shouldn't binge watch. You end up desperate for scraps of things that may not even happen. Let's, uh, just select one of these souls right quick. <coughs> I always feel kind of bad at this part. The future. Okay. It looks like. It's hard to make out, but is that? The manager? A threesome? I can't believe it. Lucifer really chose well with Kosuke. He's one of the best lusts we've ever watched. Yeah! Uh, hey, why don't you go ask Lilith if she... Wants to get drinks. I need a little private time. Just a little... Pervert. <sighs> I think I feel a little better. Yeah? Yeah, I'm sure things will go back to normal once the hype from this new song goes away. Yeah, it could. Well, as long as you're not worrying about it too much. I'm trying not to. I think these fake leaked photos will help. Have you ever, uh, tried something like this before? Not me, but I've had other people's pics stolen and uploaded. Didn't cause nearly as much of a stir as I would. <coughs> I see. We're here. Hey Josh, can you come up to the room and take one of my suitcases over to the theater? I need the stuff in it for the show in two days. Sure, I've got no place to hurry off to. Wonderful, thanks. We walk in together and head up to Pride's room. I feel slightly uneasy. Pride seems fixated on something that shouldn't really matter. Maybe it's just how he is. Is this how super prideful people are? 
Probably. So, I had a thought. What's up? It's that suitcase on the left side of the bed, Josh. Give me one sec. Just gonna talk to Kosuke real quick. No problem. What if we had Josh help us make a sex tape? The drama would be explosive. It works for other people. He can just hold the camera for some good footage. What should I say? Hmm. I think I'm gonna save it here just in case. Hmm. Yeah, okay. There we go. Alright, alright, alright. There we go. And where is the save? Where? Come on. Mouse does not want to work. I'm actually going to want to save in case we come to an uncensored scene, obviously, so yeah. Which I believe we are, so. <clears throat> hmm. What do we pick here? I'm not really comfortable with that, Luke. Babe, you would mean a lot to me. I'm so distressed over things. Would you reconsider for me? I got us a blue arrow, so that's good. Should I reconsider? Mm. I'm gonna save instead of that. I want to just save this one. Yeah. Just in case. Just in case. Hmm. Uh, I guess we'll go with B. I guess we can see if he'd be up for it. Aw, oh, babe! You make me so happy! Maybe you can talk to Josh about it. I think you'd be better at convincing him. Oh, that guy has a red arrow, so that's not good. Well, I'm going to end it here because uh, I think we're coming up on an uncensored scene for sure. So, I'm already saved it, so not worry too much about that. Well, re re save it, so yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. And I'll be back as soon as I uh, finish recording uncensored part uh, again if you want to receive any uncensored videos that I record <clears throat> you must become a patreon contributing member on the nine dollar tier or the twenty five dollar tier uh, you can find the link to my patreon within the description area just below the uh, video and remember all the money that goes into the membership uh, for people who pay to be become members goes directly to charity i don't see a penny of it. it just goes directly to charity and i will announce your name at the end of every video to show appreciation for helping out the community and becoming a, a patreon contributing member to help out the community of charities that need the funds <clears throat> so i will be back